Hi, welcome to Durham Johnson School. We are the Year 10 Leadership students. We have been working on fitness activities. Please try and join in with our circuit. Hi, the exercise we're going to do now is climbers and I've got my friend Alex to demonstrate. To do climbers, you need to place both hands on the floor directly beneath shoulders, arms fully extended and toes on the floor. Your body should form a straight line from your shoulders to your heels. Bring one knee towards the chest, leaving the other foot on the floor for support. Then return the knee or foot to the starting position, position and change legs. Alex, now you're going to give me 20. Ready, go. Well done. Faster. Brilliant. That was really good, why didn't you try that at home? Hi, the exercise we're going to be doing today is squats and I've got my friend Will here to demonstrate. To do squats properly you need to stand with feet hip width apart, keep back straight and descend towards the floor by bending knees. Bring your hips down towards the floor. Your aim is to get your thighs at least parallel to the floor whilst maintaining good form. OK Will, you're going to give me 20 squats when you're ready, go. Come on, you can do it. Go lower. Well done. Keep going. That was brilliant, Will. Well done. Why don't you try this at home? The exercise we will be doing is triangle crunches and I have got my friend Grace here who is going to demonstrate. This exercise targets the abs and obliques, core and legs. Kneel on your left leg and extend right leg to the side. Place your left hand on the floor and right hand behind your head. Bring your right knee towards your right elbow and squeeze your core. Return to the starting position and repeat. Do this on both sides. OK, Grace, you're now going to give me 20 triangle crunches, 10 on each side. Off you go. Job. Why don't you try that at home? Hi, today we're going to be the, doing the exercise burpees and I have Alex here today with me. From a standing position, drop your hands next to your feet. Next, jump your feet backwards into a press-up position. Reverse this movement by jumping your feet backwards towards your hands. As you get back into the crouching position, jump into the air with power. OK, Alex, now you're going to do 20 burpees. Three, two, one, go. Keep going. Yep, that's good. Nice one. Keep it going. Yes, good job. Keep on going. Good one. Yes, that's right. Very good. Couple more, come on. Good. Fantastic, you're doing brilliant. Alex did an amazing job there. Can you do burpees at home? The next exercise we're going to do is called bridge taps and I've got my friend Holly here to help. This exercise is good for the glutes, quads, lower back and triceps. Start off laying on, your f on the floor on your back. Raise your bottom and hips off the floor while keeping your shoulders on the ground. Reach across your body and bridge your back. 
tap your left hand over your right shoulder and repeat this on both sides. Okay, Holly, are you ready to do 20 bridge taps? Well done. Keep your hips up. What are you doing? Keep going. Well done. Keep on going. Holly did a great job there. Can you do bridge taps at home? This activity is punches, and this is my helper, Will. Keep your feet flat on the floor, shoulder width apart. Put your non-dominant foot in front and angle your body towards the target. Have a strong stance by keeping your feet wide apart. Tuck your thumb over your middle finger and make a strong fist. Raise your hands up near your chin, keeping your elbows tucked close to your body. Bend knees slightly to keep balanced. Twist hips and chest towards the target as you move your dominant hand. Extend your fist and arm fully without locking your elbow. Okay, and Will, now you're gonna give me 60. Go. Well done. As you can see, he's twisting his hips and straightening his arms fully. Well done, good. Keep going. Faster. Faster. Well done. Keep going. Faster. Faster. Well done. Good. Right, well done. That's one set. Now he's going to have a two minute rest and you have to do another nine sets to really feel your muscles work. This activity is called press ups. This is one of the most popular body weight exercises you can do. It is a good workout for the chest, core, triceps, and shoulders. I've got my helper here, Henry, and he's going to show you what to do. Place hands, shoulders width apart and arms straight, so shoulders, elbows and wrists are in line. Spread fingers slightly apart and point them forwards. Start movement by bending elbow to lower chest to the ground. Keep hips in line with the shoulders. The closer you can get to the floor, the better. Okay, Henry, now you're gonna do one set, that's 10 press-ups. Right, good form that. Keep going. Keep going, good. Good form. It's excellent, that. Henry did great with that set. Now he's going to have two minutes rest and going to give me nine more sets. This exercise is called back kicks and I've got Grace to show you how to do it. This exercise works on the glutes, lower backs, hips and core. Start on whole fours with hands under shoulders and knees under hips. Tighten core muscles so that the middle doesn't sag. Squeeze glutes and lift one leg behind you, keeping the knee bent at first and then straighten it. Reverse the movement and repeat, then change legs. Right, so we're going to do 20 of those now. So Grace, off you go. Well done. Got nice form, keep the legs straight. Well done. Remember to keep those legs straight at the end. Doing fantastic. So Grace has done, has done one set of 20 and she's gonna have a two minute break and then she's gonna try and complete another nine sets. 